لندن میں برٹش پاکستانی مسیحی برادری کی جانب سے سانحہ جڑا والا پر پاکستانی ہائی کمیشن پر احتجاجی مظاہرہ کیا گیا مظاہرین نے سانحہ جڑا والا کے مجرموں کی گرفتاری اور انہیں سزا دینے کا مطالبہ کیا مانچسٹر میں بھی پاکستانی کونسلٹ کے باہر مظاہرہ کیا گیا شہریوں نے ملزموں کو سزا دینے اور نقصانات کا ازالہ کرنے کا مطالبہ کیا واضح رہ کے گزشتہ روز نگراں وزیر اعلیٰ پنجاب محسن نقوی نے کہا تھا کہ جڑا والا واقع کی ذمہ دار مرکزی ملزم گرفتار ہو چکے ہیں جڑا والا میں خطاب کے دوران ان کا کہنا تھا کہ یہ واقعہ ہمارے لیے بہت بڑا سانحہ ہے وزیر اعظم نے ہدایت کی تھی ملوث افراد کو کیفر کردار تک پہنچائے In different areas, we have burned the church. How is it that we strongly condemn today our friend of High Commission of Pakistan, London? The extremists who were carrying a mob, they were saying, Labbaik, Labbaik, Ya Rasulallah, Labbaik, Labbaik, Ya Rasulallah, which means, which means, Extremist Muslims use Labbaik, 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 Ya Rasulallah to discriminate, to, to attack, to destroy the houses of Christians and churches in Pakistan, which is uh, even violation of their own faith, their own belief, uh, which is strongly condemned. When the people were attacking, I want to say that the Pakistani security agencies, police, were standing there and they came to inform Pakistani Christians to run away because we are failed to protect you. We are we cannot save you. We here announce that when a state cannot protect its property of its citizen, when a state cannot protect its citizens' lives, when the state cannot protect its citizen, that means that the state has failed to, to implement what responsibility what Pakistan's constitution guarantees to protect every citizen and this lunatical attack was not the first attack on Christian community. I want to mention here that in 1997 was the attack happened first. Uh, many of them was in, in Shantinagar. After that in 2009 attack was happened in uh, Gojra where nine people were burned alive and After that, Joseph Kaloni, uh, Badamibad was also hundred and hundred churches were burned and people had to leave their flat, their home, running with their children, pregnant women, children running to save their lives just near two, two kilometers far from the Prime Minister or federal government. They were failed to protect our citizens. Today we call on Pakistani government to, to give complete equal rights and protection to its citizen and then I, I want to demand that it is not the first time this is not the first time that the government has failed that they, they should protect our citizens therefore I call on Pakistani government to repeal blasphemy laws reform blasphemy laws and I call on Pakistani government to do to justice for Gujarawala and because the justice was not done in the previous first in the past incident that's why these incidents are going on keep going on today we call that pakistan must bring these perpetrator uh, to justice and a criminal, not only register the application against them a case against them but seriously take action and bring them to in just into justice and also rebuild uh, give that compensation to those families who have lost their houses who have lost their churches and immediate humanitarian aid for the those who are victims uh, sitting in the field for government or other people's community to join with us uh, in the humanitarian aid to, to respect to help Pakistani Christians who are in the field. Thank you very much.